Okay, well, what we're going to do today is do a muffler mod. We're going to change the uh, gauze mesh in there and make it a little bit bigger. The gauze mesh is located, I don't know whether you can see that there, it's located in here. There's a little screw that holds it, so uh, you can actually modify that without taking the muffler off. You can undo that little screw at the side and slide the little unit out. That's what they look like there. So that just slides in there. So you don't have to take the muffler off. But should you want to take the muffler off, it's just a matter of where you see these little uh, triangle pieces, cover, uh, covers, you put... I use this little device here, and I just put it in there, and you can prise them out quite easily. So it's straightforward to, uh, to do. So what this modification will do is actually make the saw breathe a little bit easier, maybe by about 10%, something like that there. Yeah, okay, so once you've got these little cover plates off, and they're quite easy to get off, it's just a matter of getting something like this and slightly prising them out. They come out quite easily. I just don't like to bend them or put too much force, so just take my time, and they'll come out like that. So, yeah, very easy to get out. Now, you've got to use Torx 27, so you've got to use one of those to get the bolts out. So use that and take the muffler off. Yeah, okay, look, I don't know whether you can see it or not, but it's a good idea after you pull the muffler off, just have a look at the piston to see if there's any blow-by and make sure that the piston's not all scored or anything. This piston and rings looks okay, which I'd expect it to, because the saw's only two years old and only gets used in firewood season, so yeah, that's okay, not a problem with that. Uh, it's a clamshell uh motor so it's a little bit different than some of the other older still type motors yeah okay so we've got the ms311 muffler off and i noticed that there was a little mesh or gauze in there so this is the mesh or the gauze that they have in there so what i did was make up one myself which is much bigger which will mean that It'll breathe a little bit easier. I notice that a lot of the mufflers that they're making these days for still are all one piece. So it's quite a large muffler and it only has a, a very small hole to exit. So this mesh is definitely a lot smaller than the one that I used. So the one that I used will definitely allow the saw to breathe just that little bit easier than it normally would have and it'll probably give it a slightly little bit better performance not much but a little bit better anyway so you can see the difference there maybe if i hold them both up you could see it better i'm sort of a bit i don't want to be drilling holes in, in the muffler definitely not now you can see the difference in the mesh So that'll give it a little bit of an edge. It'll make it breathe easy. I don't believe that this saw needed too much because it really does rev very high and gives great performance. Uh, but nonetheless, a slight improvement there.